Hey guys, I'm Gamer Mate, and welcome back to a new video. So I'm here back inside Roblox Studio, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own healing tool inside Roblox. So the first thing we need is a actual tool. So I'm just going to be using Toolbox and typing in Medkit. You can use whatever tool you want, and I'm just going to be using one like this. Then click No. If your tool has any scripts in it, then you can, oops, we can just delete those. So all these scripts, remote events, uh, animations, all this stuff. We can just remove those. And then once you have your tool, we can add in a script. So inside the script, we can remove print hello world and type in local tool equals the script dot parent. Then you go down twice and do tool dot activated connect function and then go down and it should appear with a bracket and then in between these two lines we can type in local humanoid equals to tool dot parent then find first child bracket speech marks and then between those brackets speech marks we can type in humanoid like that then if we go down and type in humanoid dot health equals to humanoid dot health then plus however much health you want to play to get so I'm going to be doing 10 and then there should be a script done if you close it off and then drag with tool inside the start pack like that and then to actually test out the script we need a kill brick or brick what damages your player so I'm just going to be adding a part like this and then I'll just skip ahead in the video once I've actually scripted my kill brick okay so I just quickly made this kill brick now I've scripted it and if you want to know how to make a kill brick I have a separate video of that on my channel so you can check that out so then if we click play here okay so if we quickly touch this kill brick you can see I lose some health and then if we click the tool you can see we healed up like that and then if you want you can also do the same thing but it actually damages the player so if we click stop go back in the script and instead of doing the plus we can change that to a minus and then this time if we click then you can see it actually damages our player like that and that's going to be it for today's video if this video helped make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe down below in the description you can check out my roblox group and discord server and i'll see you later Bye.